getting ready for the four kilometer long canyon run. Important thing obviously to bring on a, a canoe trip is an axe. I strap it into my Eureka canoe pack and these two grab handles are great. Whoa, 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 whoa. Day five, about to run a four kilometer class two, three. It's gonna be interesting. Kind of terrified. We've just made it down half of this four kilometer stretch of raging rapids. Super pushy, very hard to eddy out. Bucks in the boat, usually we let them run along the side. So it's a lot of fun. Beautiful canyon, but uh, get your heart pounding, I'll tell you that right now. And looks like I landed a nice brook trout. Great action on this uh, little moose look wobbler throwing it into an eddy at the base of a rapid we just ran. Produced a great brook trout, it's a beautiful fish. Still running this four kilometer stretch in the canyon. Okay, back paddle. After our horrible campsite and terrifying 4K canyon run, we are rewarded with endless, endless swifts and absolutely beautiful scenery. Wow. Through the swifts, we cruise in calm current at a relaxed pace. But then we hear the deep rumble of an approaching rapid. We thought we were done with the whitewater for the day. I consult my map to see no contour lines crossing the river and no marked rapid, but we approach with caution. Looks like we can run it on the right. All right, okay, cross draw. Draw. Back paddle. All right. Yeah, so there's a couple of big boulders there that we can split. Back sweep, hard, hard. Okay, cross draw. Okay, draw, draw, draw. Hard. Okay, paddle hard. Draw, draw, draw. Okay, cross draw. Forward hard. Oh shit, paddle hard. 
Nice. Good job, babe. All right, watch out for these boulders now. Back paddle. Okay, draw, draw, draw. Okay, cross, draw. Nice. Oh, we're getting stuck. After about a 30 kilometer paddle today, lots of rapids, lots of swifts. Seems like we found a beautiful site, a little bit of beach here, right in an old burn. Gorgeous fireweed, lots of good standing burnt trees, amazing amounts of firewood, and just a beautiful day. Hopefully the black flies don't start getting us. I'm sure they will though. This is a Novacraft Tough Stuff canoe, and let's find out how tough this stuff really is. I'm gonna look at the bottom of it. The one thing that makes me happy is that the big bashing of this canoe today has not left any major divots in this thing. Like I was expecting there to be a gouge out of the bottom or something because we just came up like this and went bam right into a boulder and then we hammered some huge standing waves and it looks like that has barely done anything. It's still super structurally sound so I'd say this boat is definitely expedition worthy.